Welcome to the Dave Show. My name is Dave, and today I'm here to talk about this fine flame camp stove. Now, the company did send me this product for a review, but they wanted me to show you what it is and how it works, and it's actually really, really cool. Uh, of course, this folds down into being a nice, uh, flat, easy to carry camp stove. But let's come on in and take a closer look, and I'll show you all the bits and pieces and components of it as well. Now, the gas tank to let you know is that does not come with it. I do have to, or you do have to, uh, supply your own gas tank, but otherwise, everything else will come with this package. I do have a, um, a little camp type uh, thing I'm going to put on here with some water in it just to show you that also does not come with the camp stove. So let's take a closer look at this camp stove. Okay, just to show you that it does uh, fit nice and flat and it has these little hooks on here to uh, close it all down and then you can just open it up and it kind of flips up in a way then on this side, there's a little uh, little latch that holds the lid up there. Now on this side, of course, is your, your gas tank. You do get this regulator arm. Again, you do not get this part. And then you actually have three burners. There's a one burner, two burners, three burners. The two on the outside are your typical type of, you know, pot burners. You can put pots and pans and different things like that on there. Now the next one is actually a little different. The burners are on the other side and they have this little tray that you can actually use to cook things on. It's also like a little you know, the drip tray kind of thing. They say that when you're using this middle one, they said always have this underneath it because uh, that probably protects the, the base part of it because the flames are aiming down. When you turn the gas on with this one, but you do need a match. You do need to get a long match um, down in there, up in there someplace to light that. So you do need a match or a lighter to light the center one. But the side burner is actually really cool because all you do is you turn it on and you hit the button and the flames go on. Now you probably cannot see the flames on there because it is um, almost invisible. I'm gonna go ahead and put this little pot on it like that. It's a little, it's a little camping uh, titanium uh, uh, pot from a Cook Escape. If you're interested in that, I'm making a video on that one as well. But I'm gonna go ahead and this is your, your control arm. You can turn it all the way up or all the way down I'm gonna go ahead and turn it up and just uh, see about boiling some water there. So as you can see, it's real easy to operate um, and it's got the stainless steel to it, the whole bit. Now this one's listed at a 20,400 BTU heat output, which is really good. Um, again, you can do the bake and uh, it's a baking and grill tray. There's a little rack here on top that keeps things elevated and stainless steel, uh, very nice. Okay, this has just been on here for a few minutes and I see some bubbles in there already and touching it, it is warm. So it only takes a few minutes to really heat up some water with this. It's got some good output. I'm gonna just go ahead and turn that off for now. Now you do wanna make sure that um, the burners are off and everything is cooled down before you pack it away. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the water part of it. And there are instructions on each, each center knob here or each knob uh, that turn clockwise, then manually ignite the burner with this one it says, and this one is you use the uh, igniters. Now there's no batteries or anything uh, with it. You don't need to plug anything. It just, uh, it just works the way it is. So it's very, very nice. Um, now when you close it up, you gotta make sure that you take the, uh, the little uh, support arm, the little lock arm off. You can take the handle off and you can remove the tray. Not a big problem. And then close this up and lock it into place. So very simple, very easy. It's, it makes a nice little compact, but big uh, at the same time, because you can cook a lot of stuff on this, a camping stove. So if you are looking for a camping stove like this, this one may be the right one for you.